The biggest thing that I find with people that do take manifestation courses or programs or hire manifestation coaches, they move into a place of peace of mind. And I think that's what we all really want is I think we all really want peace of mind. We want to be out of that suffering state. And so what I mean by that, the state of suffering is internal suffering. I want this, but I don't think that I can have it. I, you know, I'm dissatisfied with the life that I have today and I don't think there's any way to do anything different. I'm stuck in this way. I'm trapped. You know, I'm imprisoned within my own mind. And for many years, that was me. For many years, I was caught up in the storm of my own negative thoughts. The psychologist once I read, and I, his name wasn't on the document, so I can't quote him, but the psychologist talked about how so many people get, they get caught in the storm of their own thinking. And he made this analogy about a storm and how, you know, some people will go outside, they will go in the storm, they will stand right in the center of it, and they will just get hit by all the debris. Or... You can make the decision to go back into your house, close the door and observe the storm from the warmth of your own home. Maybe even turn on your fireplace and watch the storm outside, knowing that you're safe. You're in a controlled environment. And from that place, you see the beauty that is the storm. But when you're in it, you don't. And so this analogy was so good for me because I realized that when I was in the storm of my own thinking, all I could see was the negative. All I could see was the bad. I was getting hit by the debris. This person did this. This person said that, you know, this happened to me, you know, and it was like life is so hard and life is happening to me and I can't catch up. I'm so busy. I'm stressed. I'm overwhelmed. You know, all those things when all I had to do was go inside, which is within myself, turn on the fireplace, close the door and observe life for the beauty that it really is. And so that to me is the biggest effect that manifestation coaches and manifestation courses can really, really help you. Now, the way in which I see manifestation courses, the ones that are the most successful and the most powerful are the ones that don't try to confuse you with strategy. So my belief is that success is 99% consciousness and 1% strategy. So what I mean by that is you cannot take action in your business without your corresponding consciousness. So the identity that you hold today, you take action in your business. So whether it's strategy A, strategy B, strategy C, you have the same consciousness taking all three strategies. So to say that one strategy is going to work over the other, to me is not my experience. But if you change your consciousness, if you change who you are, how you see yourself, your confidence, your discipline, your persistence, your resilience, you become more magnetic and people start to love you and follow you and you're happy and you're grateful and you're loving and people start to just absolutely love what you're doing, your point of attraction is different. Your behavior is different. How you see you is different. So when you take strategy A, B or C, all three will work because your consciousness works, because your consciousness is powerful, because your consciousness is everything. And so doing any of those three strategies with a consciousness of failure will result in failure doing all three strategies in a consciousness of success will create success. So when we sign up for a strategy course or a program, or we hire a business coach, my best piece of advice is to take a manifestation course first. Learn how to create the best of yourself, then hire somebody to help you take different action. For so many years, I was in the network marketing industry and I overwhelmed myself with strategy trainings. I was watching how do I brand myself on social media and how do I do attraction marketing and how do I convert more sales and how do I, you know, what scripts do I use and how do I sell more products? And I was always seeking all of this information to help me to make more money, to have more business success, to do better. But the moment I went within, the moment I started studying me, I changed my consciousness, everything started to work. My business started just flourishing and booming no matter what I said, no matter what strategy. I started to get everything that I wanted. 